Hey everyone, hope you're doing fantastic. Just looking at this uh, pallet of grass seed that we had recently delivered and it made me think about this question we get often about grass seed and what is the best type of grass seed to put down and while I'm not here to endorse a particular product, I just wanted to make you aware so when you go buy your grass seed you make an informed decision and not necess necessarily buy what's on sale and what's best suited for your site. So on each bag, there's this label, as you can see right here. And on this label, it has some pretty neat things. It tells you about the grass seed, who made it, uh, the lot number, what kind of grass seeds in it, percentage it will germinate. But what I wanna show you on this uh, label here, as you can see, is it has something called other components. And under other components, it talks about other crop seeds. And on this label particularly, it says 0%. So when you look at that, what does that mean? So that's agriculture crop. It's anything other than like uh, the fescue that's in this bag. And anything that's more than 5%, they have to tell you what that is. Below that is inert matter. And this is less than 1%, that's good. Inert matter is stuff that's not gonna do you any good in this grass seed, it's not gonna germinate. And then you also have weed seeds. Weed seeds in this bag is 0%. And that's what you wanna look for, in my opinion, something that shows 0%. You don't wanna be introducing any weeds into your lawn this fall that, uh, as you sow the grass seed. And the last thing is noxious weed seed per pound. And this bag shows zero, none. So what does noxious mean? Well, each state declares a weed noxious, uh, depending on the region. And for this seed, there's none in it. Uh, noxious weed can be anything like poana, which is an annual grass, or something that's very hard to control whether that's through chemical or cultural practices. So, some pretty neat information, but there's some really important stuff right there I wanted to point out. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. I'm gonna include a link below with some more information on what you should be looking at on this label, and so you can make an informed decision. Hope you have a great day. If you have any questions, let us know. Take care, bye.